Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Today, we are continuing forward with the Weirding Woods, the zombie story mode area, and getting more done to get the dummy back. So we need to continue forward with all that. Of course, last episode, or the episode before that one actually, we got started with the Weirding Woods. Over this way, we have an imp to talk to. We talked to her last episode as well. But uh, yeah, we also have a couple of abilities for the imp. I haven't played the imp in Battle for Neighborville, so this is pretty cool. He has the gravity grenade, pull and hold enemies to a location, just like in Garden Warfare 2. He has the Robo Call to call on his powerful mech and the Imkata, or as I like to call it, the break dancing. <laughs> wow, it's really good in this one, too. He just keeps going. Um, and then we got the Robo Call, which I can't do quite yet. We'll do that later. Alrighty, so let's talk to you, uh, Izzy. Hi, P, you, you stink like Colt. I mean, I guess we, we're entering the realms of the dummy cult. What's that? You need stickers? Lucky for you, I drop my badges in slime, so they'll stick to anything. Oh, that's good. Zombie prepared. Calling all scouts. Some flowers have been putting out Izzy's fun forest fire, so no. Help her get revenge to earn cool stickers for the boom box. Well, well, which is definitely something we really need to do, so let's get started with this for today's episode. Zombie prepared. Find scout cookies to earn stickers for the boom box. You got it. Sitka Colt's got you fixing a boombox to put a forest to sleep? They're nuts. Wait, you need stickers to fix it? Why not earn some stickery badges? You see, this overgrown forest is full of pesky pests that need to learn a lesson. Especially those sunflowers. Every fun little forest fire I start, they put out. It's really baking my beans. I sent them my special scout cookies, but they never got there. Smell your way to my cookies. That's your orienteering, uh, that's your orienteering badge. Make sure my cookies get delivered and the cookie delivery badge is all yours. And vanquish as many sunflowers as possible for the first aid badge, but find my cookies first. That's three cool sticker badges to slap on that boom box. Ooh, I just get so excited about badges, don't you? I guess. All right, checkpoint reached. My cookies smell strong. Follow, follow your nose holes to sniff them out. Hmm, well, the imp definitely has some nose holes. Where exactly is it? Okay, cookie smell. Oh, it's one of these like meter filling ones. So the closer we get, the more the meter will fill up. So we just need to pay attention to how that changes as we move forward. And I also get to play as the imp a little bit, which is always fun. Gotcha, ooh, the imp's primary weapon is good. That's really good. Alrighty, let's go over this way. It's like super accurate, very little recoil, lots of quick fire damage, that's what I wanna seeing a primary weapon. Might have to experiment with it a little bit. But overall, I really like that. And I've heard that the Imkata is a lot better than it was in Garden of Warfare 2. It definitely seems like it. Anyways, our cookie smell is going up and up. Okay, don't hit me with that. Back it up. Oh, gotcha. Uh, maybe a little bit more over this way. Uh, I might be going the wrong way. Yeah, I think it's over here. Oh, it's really going up now. Has to be somewhere, whoa, around here, there's an acorn. Is that a pink sunflower? Weird. I'm gonna throw that down. Let's turn into our Mackie. I know that sunflower. She puts out my fires. Put her out. Will do. All right. Whoa, <laughs> look at this. Oh, this is cool. This is really cool. So it looks like he has the rockets again, and he does have the, it's not really as much of a stomp as it is a punch downwards. A lot different than the, well not a lot different, but actually yeah, very similar is what I have to say to the original mech. I'm yearning to do some burn and dig up my cookies. So they're here? Oh no, right here, gotcha. You got it, we get a big cookie that's partially eaten. Checkpoint reached. All right, chocolate chip, my cookies are not basic, keep sniffing. So this isn't your cookie, this just hap happens to be a cookie in the area. Huh, so let's keep looking for more cookies. Whoa, I just, it's weird that that can happen. It looks like it was going up when I was going this way. So I definitely just gonna keep at that for now. Oh boy, um, you sense a faint gnomish energy. I wonder where there might be one around here, I'm not really sure. Anyways, oh I can actually like hover for a bit too. That's a new addition, like he always had the, the devil jump. I don't know if it's going up anymore. Definitely not that way though, it has to be this way. Yeah, it's going way up when we go over here. Okay. Way, way up. Oh, hello. 
Uh, I'll put the anti-gravity right there. It is sort of harder to be accurate with the anti-grav, if you ask me. There we go. Nice. Keep going this way then? I suppose so. Can you leave me alone or not? I guess not, so I'm gonna have to just break dance on you. Not doing as much damage as before, there it goes. Towards the end, it does more damage. It just sort of stacks up. Yeah, it's going up. Whoa, okay, I guess it's just gonna mark it out for me. Oh, they got me, yikes. <laughs> that's not good. How much do I have to retry? That really hurt. I mean, that's sort of the danger about playing his imp. He has such little health that he can be taken out pretty easily with that kind of stuff. Okay, um, we're way back here. Okay, well, at least I know where it is now, so I don't have to dilly-dally so much, but that was such a far drawback. Ooh, we got some dandelions. I haven't seen too many dandelions in this game. They were new in Garden Warfare 2. I mean, honestly, all well, all those spawnable plants were. You couldn't spawn plants like that in uh, Garden Warfare 1. Okay, I should be able to get up here. There we go. This is a little bit of a shortcut. And then let's deal with this again. Everybody is back, of course. It can be a bit difficult to hit moving targets, but I feel like it's just a little bit more about getting used to it. Nobody over that way. I'm gonna toss that way over there. Hopefully you get somebody. No. Watch it, no fair, that sunspot is stealing them, destroy it. I'll try to. It's stealing the cookies though? I don't really understand. Anyways, it's time for the mech. Oh boy. I didn't even really try the primary weapon out too much for this, because I didn't need to before. There we go. Take out the acorn now and then going over this way. Do I have to destroy the sun? That's a little excessive. I mean, it's not the sun, it's just a piece of sun. This is interesting. Whoa. Huh. So where are those cookies at? That'll teach him to prevent forest fires. Get digging. All right, I'm gonna hop out of the mech then. Where exactly do I dig? Over here? Over here. Where are my cookies? Another chocolate chip. Or maybe this is like oatmeal raisin. Doesn't look like it. Oh, no it is, oatmeal raisin, we're looking for cookies, not garbage, sniff on, yikes. Total burden, anybody who likes ra oatmeal raisin. Uh, <laughs> cookie smell. So it looks like it still wants me to go this way. Man, it looks like the mech is down for like two minutes too, that's crazy. Quite a while. Okay. Oh gosh, oh, don't fall too far. Oh, we're getting close. What is that? I don't know. Gotta get rid of the sunflower. Oh, it's a champion. Smells like BO mixed with really bad BO. It's my cookies. I do not want your cookies anymore if they smell like that. Oh boy, I'm getting attacked from behind as well. That's not good. Who's getting me from over here? I don't really know. Okay, maybe the soldiers around here can help me out though. That'd be fantastic. Oh boy, come on. Gotcha. So who's over here? Is it just the sun that's hurting me? I mean, it might be. Got it, okay. So we did it, this is the dirt pile. Now dig, you dig. All right, as soon as it lets me, I will. Any second now, there it is. Come on, this has to be the cookie. Right? I don't know. Whoa, that's a gargantuar with a bomb cookie. Oh, there's a cookie on the bomb, yeah. Well, we found it, guard cookies as he brings, oh, the sunflowers. An explosive treat. The gargantuar is named Cookie. Well, what, what do you know? <laughs> That's great. All right, let's guard this gargantuar. We got some plants over this way. We should be able to take them out, no problem. Got him. I am a little low on health, though, and I need to be careful about that. I really don't want to get taken out. I don't see too many others, though, so that should be good. Oh, wait. Here they come. A lot of a, uh, of the terracotta weed, I think they're called. Got it, got it, and buddy, you get back here. Level two achieved with the imp. That's cool. Oh, Acorn's coming in. Hey, leave me alone, Acorn. I got things to do, places to be. Everybody's avoiding my anti graph Not able to defend the gnome, not the gnome. <laughs> what am I talking about? Uh, the uh, cookies, the gargantuar all that much from over here. The Acorns are beating me up. Got him, okay, not too bad. It's all right, cookies, we'll make it. Oh, no, dandelions, back up, cookies, back up. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Giant dancing tree over this way. Okay, where are the sunflowers at? 
I don't know. You okay, cookies? He's walking. Uh, I don't know. Whoa, what's happening? Earthquake, no, it's a giant tree. We should have known. Cookies, where'd you go? Treadwood tossed my cookies, so rude. Yikes, nobody likes tossed cookies. Whoa. She's saying something, but I can't hear it. I don't know, that, that was weird. Like, it, she was, oh, it, it popped up for a second. I don't know what that said. Anybody's guess. Okay, well, for now, let's get rid of this. Oh, are you healing the tree? I guess so, weird. I guess the tree needs healing. There we go. Oh, whoop, there we go. Got it. Wowee. Oh man, what did that do? Whoa! It's a uh, it's a queen sunflower, right? Look at that, the sunflower sovereign. Battle this royale. It's a sunflower sovereign. She's a royal pain in the patoot. Where is she? I don't know, but we got a treasure chest as well. Let me grab that really quickly. Oh man, this is awesome. I love the sunflower queen. Hopefully there's the hypno flower as well. That'd be awesome as well. Anyways. Uh, she's gonna be tough as an imp. If I could just wait it out until my mech pops up, that might be our best bet, and just sort of try to play peekaboo with her a little bit. Just poke around the corners, hit her with, with what I got, and then leave it like that. Where are you going? Come back. Oh, but don't come back, don't come back. Actually, stay where you are. She was not happy with me there. She's like going the long way around. We've already got a little bit of her health done. Is she like afraid of me? Like, what's the deal out here? Get back here. Oh, lots of damage there. That big sunflower gets her power from the sunspots. Blast them. Where are the sunspots? There's one over this way. Okay, go for it. And break dance all over it. Honestly, didn't do too much damage, I guess. There we go, got another plant vanquished though. Over this way, getting this one out of here. Oh boy, very cool. Yeah, I wonder what other Garden Warfare 2 bosses we can expect in this game. Good one, hurry, get her while she's weak. I'm trying. Ow, who's attacking me from over here? It's this guy, got him. Okay, I'm trying to get you without getting beat up too much. Easier said than done. Oh, hello, Sunflower. Nice, okay. I would like to come in from this side. It seems like it's easier to shoot over to our right than our left, so we can peek around the corner like this. Oh, more sunflowers coming in. I have five seconds until my mech, though, and that'll really change a lot of stuff up. For right now, I need to toss it over as far as I can. That got both of them. So if I could rush over really quickly, now that they're a little distracted, I can do the Imkata. That is like not doing any damage to them. In fact, it's doing a lot more damage to me. That really stinks. Like sometimes it's a little picky, the Imkata seems to do a lot of damage, but then sometimes not really. So how much do I have to retry? I don't know if I've actually died during a boss yet. I mean, I actually, no, I've died during old school. Um, the whole thing? The whole thing, well that sort of stinks. I'm gonna save my mech until things get a little nastier, I feel. Like at least after the first phase, I'll do it then, but I might just wait and see for now. Okay, we're going into phase two, I'm gonna spawn in the mech. Good one, hurry, get her while she's weak, I'm trying. Uh, so here we go. Oh man, that does so much damage, it's crazy. Let's get over there quick, I know there's a lot of sunflowers around here, I also need to put an end to as soon as this is done reloading. Gotcha. And one more, I'm just gonna stomp you. And then go for you. Oh, ho, ho. I love it, it's great and it does lots of splash damage. Destroy the sunspot thingies, I'm trying. The mech lasts for a while, too. I mean, it has health, of course, we need to be careful of that. I need to get rid of the sunflower before she heals. Stop hiding behind her. <laughs> Stop having good ideas. I got 15 seconds to destroy these, so I need to go for it. Where are they? There's, um, I don't have enough time for this. The sunflowers are too distracting. Oh no, and they're all like out of my line of sight. Come on, move it, mech, move it, go. Oh, I'm out of time. Too slow, the Sovereign healed, gets stronger, and smells nicer. Dang, is she fully healed? I'm down to 15 health. She's not, luckily. Man, that's crazy. Um, Let's try this again, then. Her shield is down, get the queen. I would love to. This is so far looking like a tough fight. Come back here. 
This mech is just too slow. Here we go. Do as much damage as possible. She's definitely not as weak as she was before. Yeah, she's only taking like five damage hits now. I mean, maybe that was supposed to happen. Probably not though. Okay, there's that done. And I need to be very careful about this. I'm trying to land whatever damage I can. And if this doesn't work out, I might have to change classes. Okay, well she's very unhappy with me. Oh, you get back here, I'm not done with you. Okay, there she goes. I really gotta pay attention to when she, oop, when she starts putting in her sun things, because that's when I'm in trouble. That's when I need to immediately focus on those, or she'll heal up and that won't be good. Ow, 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 I need to find another hidey spot. Right here seems good to me. Okay, get the sunflowers to leave me alone. But this is where it's like she can really catch up to me in a way I don't appreciate. See, like, why is that not doing any damage? Okay, now it sort of is, but the first half of it doesn't do too much, weirdly enough. I'm trying to focus on the sunflower because if not, the, the, the queen sunflower is just gonna keep getting healed. I don't know why you're just healing Dreadwood, but I don't appreciate it. Okay, who's over here? Nobody, it was just her? Okay, she's almost halfway down. If I get to seal for a moment, I don't know if she's gonna let me do that. Ow, ow, ow. I need to skedaddle. Let's see if we can't let the auto heal activate. I don't have any upgrades right now for the imp, so maybe that's why I'm having such a hard time. That's it, that's it. There we go. So where is she now? Luckily there's no timer just normally fighting her. It's just when uh, the, the sun drops show up. But then she just spawns in more sunflowers, which makes for more of a hassle. Jeez, and they're really good at firing at me. <laughs> gotcha. And you would think that she's probably just about ready to go into her next phase. I mean, she's, I mean, I say that, but at the same time, I'm not really sure. I'm very hesitant to do the, the mech now, because last time it was too slow and that's what really messed me up. Okay, going back over here, she's running away from me. Oh, what are you doing? Don't do that, ow. Where is she now? The only problem is like whenever I can hit her, she can hit me back. And I'm trying to make the most of it when that's not happening. But she's getting lower and lower. Come on, where'd you go? Oh. Cause I just don't wanna activate the mech and then she immediately, ow, go into her next phase. Cause that would really mess me up. I'd have to hop out of the mech right away. Jeez. Another sunflower. Cause there's always another sunflower. <laughs> Oh boy. If I can, I would like to wait a second, but no, they just keep spawning in around here. I need to find a place to hide so I can heal up again. I know it's a little bit of a tedious thing to do, but it's sort of my only option. Come on. There it is, there it is, there it is. Running back over now that we're at full health. Cause she's just still just chilling out over here. All right, you know, I know this is gonna happen this way, but it's just taking too long. Go for ya. My best bet is right here. Just pelt her with missiles. Yep, I told you. Okay, so I'm immediately gonna start going for them if I can. I don't know where they are. Um, there's one right over there. Is that the only one? Okay, then I have to hop out of the mech because I'm going too slow and I really need to get there, like right now. So we have 20 something seconds. Here's the first one. There we go, and that gives me some extra time once I pop them, so that's good. I might have actually exploded one when I hopped out of my mech. Oh, come on, I didn't actually wanna fall down here. Come on, get it quickly. Get another extra like 25 seconds there. Go, 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 go. She's just sort of chilling out. Okay, another one right here. Awesome, we're almost back up to a minute of time left. I still have 83 seconds for my Mac. Go, 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 go. Right here. Got it. See, I'm not worrying about it this time. So her shields are down, bring the pain. 
So this is when we're really so supposed to damage her down because we do extra damage here too. The problem is that I can't get back there in time without being totally pelted by sunflowers. Yeah, I'm just doing normal damage to her. I don't know if there was like a moment in time there where I could have done extra. Sort of hard to tell at times. But for right now, she isn't doing the best. Like, she's pretty low on health. So if we could just survive and not die, because if we die, we have to do all of this over again, I'm pretty sure, unless they tell us that a checkpoint's been reached. So she's back to healing up, or at least to doing her meditation. So I need to find out where the sun drops are. Uh, that's the most sunspots I've ever seen. Your toast, new cookies. Oh my gosh, nuh -uh, not happening. I'm getting all of these. I'm getting every single one of them. If it's the last thing I do, whoa, what's happening? Whoa. Is she like exploding or something? Too much sun? <gasps> it's cookies. He's back. Oh no. And here come his cookies. Oh boy. Duck and cover. <laughs> Yikes. Zombie prepared complete. And we get some cool stickers for it, sticky badges for the Divine Boom Box. That was crazy. We also get the trophy earned, Gone Camping. That was amazing, Scout's Dishonor. Wasn't that crazy? Oh, it looks like this is the uh, guy for the challenge chest here. You got cool stickers, get tape and batteries, and you is cool. Wow, okay, so that was a lot of fun. Super crazy. <laughs> I just can't believe it, that was awesome. Um, but yeah, we were able to take on the Queen Sunflower and stuff too. So some of these quests are definitely longer than others. I was hoping that one would take me a little bit more time. But uh, for right now, I figured what we'll do for the rest of today's episode is that we will go back. Well, actually, I'm going the wrong way for that. Well, no, I'm actually in the perfect spot, right? I'm trying to find out where the uh, shop guy is because we should be able to buy another map full of chests, which is exactly what I want to get started with. So let's try that. If my board of directors weren't the best, they wouldn't need, not need your help, huh? I don't know. Uh, but for right now, we have 150 marshmallows. We have 278, so we can definitely afford this. Uh, purchase it up for the Z-Tech factory area, and we'll just spend the rest of today's episode getting every chest we can in this area. That'll be perfect. Be disappointed, check. <laughs> All right, all right. Um, so yeah, let's take a look at everything in the Z-Tech factory area. Of course, we've already found a good chunk of these, but there are still more to find, and that's my goal right now, is to find the as much of them as I possibly can. I'm gonna guess it's up there, because I don't think I've been up there. So let's see if we can't find a way to do that. Um, actually, there's not. Looks like it's more over this way. A little to our left. Oh, just right over here. Uh, yep, here we go. So yeah, we'll just try to find as many chests as we can. Level five achieved, very cool. And where's the next one? Oh, and we got 20 marshmallows. So we're already making our marshmallows back. Right here. So that is that way. Looks like those soldiers are just indefinitely fighting the dread roots. Got it. More marshmallows, more coins, more of everything. And you know, if we get more marshmallows, it's great because it can help us afford other things. And if we eventually buy everything, we can then eventually also get the, um, what's it called? We can still get money, just coins. You can, you know, do that. So that's always awesome. It's something I'm sure we'll eventually do. Okay, so what's going on up that way? It looks like we have another one on top of a train. So of course, this was the area we were at just a moment ago. There's still like a big piece of dread root here. Maybe I'll fight these guys real quick. Yeah, so far it's a lot of fun with the Imp. I cannot wait to showcase this guy and play him online. It seems like it's gonna be a ton of fun. There we go, we got him. But I might need, oh, hello. I might need the Space Cadet to properly get up here. I mean, I guess I could do this and that. That does it, <laughs> that works. All righty, here we go. A 10,000 coins is a really good one. Usually it's a little less than that. Uh, so that's that one done. Moving this way now, a little bit farther down the railroad. I think it's just right there. Oh yeah, I saw this one when we were fighting uh, the queen. I love this pink sunflower. It's a champion too. There we go. Awesome. And I'm just going to do the break dance on you guys. I can avoid the potato mine. Actually, this is becoming really problematic. If I walk in the potato mine though, it might not turn out so well. There we go. Now I just have to focus on the cactus. Oh geez. 
much more difficult with a moving target. Got it. I might as well get these. Gives me 10 experience each. Very worth it. Got it, and wasn't there another one? I guess not. Okay, so first off, this treasure chest, I saw the other one right there, so I'll grab that too. Thank you very much. This has 20 marshmallows. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I was not expecting to turn the corner to see that. Well, Oak, meet Mac. Oh boy. Got it. Let's fire our missiles at him. He has two acorns on top of him. All right, well that was great. So one thing I definitely missed in my acorn showcase is that the acorn can actually heal the oak. I'm sorry that I'm like the biggest dingus of all time, and I totally missed that fact. But I will be sort of technically re-showcasing all of the plants and zombies once we get them all mastered. I plan on doing videos covering you know all their upgrades and stuff. So that'll be my chance. That'll be way down the line for now because it's gonna take us time to master everybody. A marigold is near. I can't move. That was weird. Uh, for right now, gotta get this treasure chest. Sort of stinks that the marigold shows up right at the end of me having the mech. How can I get up here? Fix all of my boombox, these mini blocky vines. Oh, this one right here, okay. I'll keep that in mind. There we go, I knew I could get up there. It is sort of weird how you gotta get up to some of these places. I'm sure there's more than one option, but it seems like maybe Space Cadet or Super Brains might be another good one, depending on how his jump still works, or the soldier, because he has the rocket jump. Anyways, there's 20 marshmallows. Very good. And let's see what else we can get done. There's another treasure chest right over yonder, down this way, so it's probably gonna be under. Just like that, yeah, in this little cave system. This does not look structurally sound. I don't wanna be under here for very long. And boom, we get 20 more marshmallows. All right, well, that's not too bad. And in this one right here, what do we got? Hopefully something good. You sense a faint gnomish energy, that's cool. Whoa, another cactus? Whoa, two for one deal with the cactuses, or cacti, sorry. There we go, oh boy. And what about you? Oh, gotcha. Okay, we'll, we'll go and grab that stuff in a second. Let's just first grab this chest so we don't have to double back. Another 10,000, very good. We might just about, about be at 10, uh, not 10, 1 million coins. That's pretty cool. Let's take a look in just a second. There we go. We have 967,000 coins and I'm gonna do that. So we're going down here now. Yeah, this one's pretty simple. Thank you. 7,500 coins. Oh, and then there's another one right here. I'll grab that one nice and easy. And then I think there's only a couple more. You know what, if you're gonna be right here, oh, wait, come back, come back. My mech's not very quick, you have to wait for me. Oh no. <laughs> Maybe I should just get you as much as I can now. Oh, here we go. Just stay still, stay still, please. Oh, that's good, that's really good. I mean, if, I, if you drop the crystal dog, that wouldn't be too bad of a deal. Ooh, slam ya. Oh, that must have hurt. Come on, come on, come on, just a little bit more, a little bit more. Yeah, we did it! Wow, look at that. And there it is, the crystal dog. Okay, so let me grab this really fast. Oh, I can't use my abilities when that happens. Fragility overwhelms you, I can't sprint either. What happens if I take damage, do I drop it? I'm not sure. Uh, I'll grab this one. Now I might have to come back for this or something. Uh, but then, yeah. Oh boy, I'm a little bit worried about this. I don't know what happens, do I have to take no damage at all? Do I just not have to die? I don't know what the dealio is. Right now though, there's 50 marshmallows, that's pretty good. I think we just about made all of our marshmallows back. Oh look at this, it's solo ops, oh cool. We'll definitely do this at some point. I need to do more solo ops for uh, the town center as well. Oh no, it's just right over here. Okay, perfect, so that's going to be every single a uh, chest in the Z-Tech factory area. And that's another 20 marshmallows. Okie doke. So up this way. We got you. Ow, that hurt. That definitely hurt. The music here is always so intense. I just gotta be really careful as we get this little pup back to the well guy. 
I have 400, I had, yeah, about 400 pieces to go. Okay. Keep moving. I know, I know. This is where I'm really worried. We got the dread root over this way. If I could avoid him, that'd be fantastic, but there's really only one way to go here. I'm gonna have to move it quick, as quick as I can. It looks like I can press a button to probably drop it. I don't know if it like gets destroyed if you drop it, so I'd ow, rather not risk it. Okay, this is not cool, not cool. I'm trying to jump, it's not letting me. Really? <laughs> it just like wasn't letting me jump. Okay, well, is my pup still there or is it gone for good? I'm gonna guess that it's gone for good. I don't even know where I am right now. Where did I get taken out? It wasn't over this way, it was right over here. Oh, that stinks. Cause I was right there too, I was trying to get away. Yeah, it's not here anymore. Oh well, at least I tried. And we got every chest in the area, so that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty happy with that when it comes to our progress for today's episode. How many marshmallows do we have now? 334. One thing I wanted to do, I don't know what's really going to happen, but I wanted to try, oh boy, throw that down. Ooh, get you, oh jeez, you dodged out of it. I wanted to try giving some of my marshmallows to the fire. There's like a campfire place, and it's not going to be one of the crystal gnomes, right? I mean, it might be. Actually, it might be because he hasn't said anything. He hasn't actually shown me the locations. We know of one of the crystal gnomes already. So maybe I can talk to him and he'll give me the other locations. But maybe I should see my marshmallows. We still have other things we could buy and stuff, so maybe we'll leave it like that. Let's get you if I can. Good enough, good enough. <laughs> okay, and here's the squash again. I love this dude. Oh boy. Come on, come on. I haven't found any other gnomes out. Oh, almost got him. I could spawn in my mech, I just don't think it's necessary. There's actually another golden gnome right there on top of the bridge, how'd I miss that one? Maybe I've already gotten it? I don't think I have though. There's not a marker on the top of it. So I'll go and grab that in just a moment. Uh, level seven achieved for the imp, that's cool. So what do we have to do to get up there? I think we need to hop on top of this thing. If I can. I got up there pretty easily with the space cadet, but it's proving to be a bit more difficult with the imp. There we go, oh, come on, really? That was baloney. Come on, ready? There we go, much better. So let's go and grab this golden gnome. Oh, there's another marigold. Okay, this, oh, it is a race though. Okay, well the marigold can wait for a second, can it? Cash that gnome, there it is. Um, where is it now? Where is it now? Where is it now? Um, I don't know, can you just get out of my face, pea shooter? You guys are ruining my day right now. There, okay, they're gone. You are about to be gone. You ready for this? Are you ready for this? Yeah, you better just stay right there. Because I am sick of you. Where are you gonna go, right down this way? I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't think so. Ow. <laughs> Wait, no, I don't wanna do that there, come on. Where are you going? You better not get away this time. I'm gonna be furious if you do, because you're so close, you're in such a convenient location. I have the mech out and everything. Stop doing that. Because the Marigold will eventually run away. Just like the Yeti will. Oh, come on, come on. Where are you now? You're in here. Ready? Wait. Marigold disappeared, come on! Why did she stay around and was so convenient when she was like all the way across the map? Oh, that's so baloney. All right, I'm getting back up there. I'm catching that gnome no matter what because everything's going wrong now. Everything was going so good and now it's going so not good because everybody was in the way when I was trying to get the gnome. You guys are all getting beat up, that's for sure. See ya, you're out of here. How are you not beat up? You are now. Jeez Louise. Come on, get up here, and then sprint. Thank you very much. So, what's the dealio with this? I can grab this one and that one, but now the problem is where does it go after this? Up on there, okay. My best bet is probably, go, 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 go! 
Did I get it? I got it. Next one is over here. This might just be easy with the space cadet. I don't know, with some of these crazy jumps, it's really demanding. Got him. Over here, over here. And in this corner. And then that's it. We got the golden gnome. Thank you very much, golden gnome collected. Alrighty, well we did a pretty good job in today's episode. I feel we got yet another golden gnome. We're almost at a million coins and we got every single chest in the Z-Tech factory area. Next time around we'll do another quest to take on uh, another thing of the boom box. That'll be cool. And along with it, we will try to get all the chests in the stirring swamp. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Before you go, be sure to comment Marshmallow Zebra so now you watch at the end of the URA Zebra Task Viewer. Also, subscribe to join the Zebra Herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.